Alzheimer's dementia is part of the dementia spectrum, uh, which includes Alzheimer's disease and vascular changes. And always, in every patient, you see a combination of the two. Uh, therefore, the drugs that are used uh, for Alzheimer's disease are also used for patients who have vascular dementia. What we call neurotrophic factors. So these are factors that uh, exist in, in the brain of uh, everyone, uh, which maintain the uh, neurons, prevent the neurons from dying, uh, let, uh, allow the establishment of connection between neurons and other neurons, which are important, of course, for uh, maintaining cognition. And uh, lack of uh, neurotrophic factors is uh, regarded as one of the possible causes of dementia, and uh, therefore maybe a replacement of uh, the deficient neurotrophic factors by cerebralizing can prevent uh, the ongoing deterioration. The protection that uh, we have is uh, really uh, all kinds of interventions that should reduce the risk of developing dementia. So we know that uh, dementia uh, can be precipitated by smoking, by high blood pressure, by uh, high cholesterol levels, by lack of physical activity, and all these things and others should be addressed in order to uh, prevent the development of dementia and even when dementia has started to prevent it from progressing.